So we've picked up the car. Um, Take the next left. It's very modern. Um, it's very smooth. Quite impressed with everything so far. And uh, we're going to see how it goes for the next two weeks. The kids are loving it. Drives quite smooth. It's a bit strange. It keeps cutting from engine to electricity when you're going slowly. But you get used to it. It's really, really quiet to drive. We're doing about 50 miles an hour and it's still really quiet and we're currently getting 60 miles to the gallon with the air conditioning on which I think is pretty good. What about the cruise control? Have you had a bash at that? No, I haven't used that. It's great fun. You can waggle both legs off the paddles. It's a dream to drive. It's so easy. There's um, no difference between driving this a hybrid and any other car. I don't mind driving anyway but this is pleasurable. It's very very comfortable. I took um, a long motorway drive a few days ago and just the, the seat comfort, the cruise control came into its own. This is your parking brake. This is really easy to use so just switch it from drive into reverse. This is the power button on the keyless entry and smart start feature. There are my keys. Nowhere near the uh, steering wheel as you would get in a usual car. There's some central storage here in between the two seats. It's quite a big storage space actually. I'm going to try and demonstrate the sat nav. So let's calculate route. We're going to York, press go. And that's it, we're done. 31 minutes, 19 miles away. Keys are in the bottom of my bag. Keyless entry. Voila. I put £25 worth of petrol in the other day and it gave me over half a tank. So we're looking at probably £50 maximum to fill it up and that will definitely do over 400 miles. We've got an array of saxophones, trumpets and several guitars. At any given time we could have up to five instruments to transport depending on concerts, rehearsals, lessons, bands and what have you. Should we see for the boot shuts? I think it's been a successful mission. When you're at junctions or roundabouts, when you need that little extra bit of oomph to get you get you going and get you out in time. Um, I was worried with the hybrid that, that it wasn't going to have that, but it's, with the 1.8 engine, it, it, it splits seamlessly between the two, so you've got the power of a, a normal car combined with the hybridness. Um, so I've had absolutely no problems with that at all. The kids love it. Um, I certainly like it and um, keep thinking of all different ways how I can actually afford to buy one. Oh, we're really sad. We are really sad. Don't want to take it back. Overall, I think this is an excellent car. I would thoroughly recommend it to anyone who was looking to, to buy a, a hybrid. Go on, we love the Toyota. <laughs> <laughs> we love the Toyota.